The Body Project, An Intimate History of American Girls, by Joan Jacobs Brumberg is a thought-provoking exploration of the complex and evolving relationship between American girls and their bodies throughout history. Brumberg takes readers on a journey through time, shedding light on the ever-shifting standards of beauty, the impact of societal pressures, and the transformation of girlhood in the United States. The book primarily focuses on the 19th and 20th centuries, offering a comprehensive historical analysis of how girls' bodies became sites of scrutiny, control, and transformation. Brumberg's work delves deep into the socio-cultural, medical, and psychological aspects of girlhood, revealing how girls' bodies have been shaped by external forces and societal expectations. One of the key themes in the book is the commodification of beauty. Brumberg demonstrates how girls have been bombarded with messages and products aimed at making them conform to ever-changing ideals of beauty. She argues that capitalism and consumerism have played a significant role in the development of these standards, as the beauty industry profits from girls' insecurities. This analysis is particularly relevant in the modern era, where the beauty and fashion industries continue to exert tremendous influence over girls' self-perception. Brumberg also examines the role of the medical profession in shaping the bodies of American girls. She discusses how medical interventions, such as corsets and diet pills, were often prescribed to young girls to mold their bodies according to prevailing norms. This medicalization of girlhood led to long-lasting physical and psychological consequences, with girls feeling the pressure to conform to a narrow and often unhealthy ideal. Throughout the book, Brumberg highlights the intersection of gender, class, and race in shaping the body ideals imposed on girls. She reveals that the experience of girlhood has not been uniform it has been profoundly influenced by socioeconomic status and racial background. This intersectionality is a significant element of the analysis, as it shows how certain groups of girls have faced even more severe body-related challenges and discrimination. Moreover, the author explores the impact of media, including magazines, television, and now the Internet, on girls' body image and self-esteem. Brumberg's research reveals how media representations of beauty, often unrealistic and unattainable, have contributed to the development of girls' anxieties about their bodies. She argues that the proliferation of digitally altered images in the media has further exacerbated this issue, making it a modern-day challenge that is pervasive and unrelenting. Brumberg also discusses the contemporary phenomenon of girl power, and the pursuit of empowerment through self-improvement and self-expression. She acknowledges the positive aspects of girls' increasing agency and autonomy in shaping their identities and bodies. This evolving perspective on girlhood is portrayed as a response to the historical pressures that have been placed on girls. The Body Project is meticulously researched and filled with poignant historical anecdotes and personal stories. It draws on diaries, letters, and medical records to offer a deeply personal and intimate history of American girls' experiences. The inclusion of these primary sources adds authenticity and relatability to the narrative, allowing readers to connect with the individual struggles and triumphs of the girls and women whose voices are captured within the pages. Overall, Brumberg's analysis in The Body Project sheds light on the pervasive influence of societal norms, media, and the medical industry on American girls' self-perception and body image. Her work is a call to action, advocating for a more compassionate and holistic approach to understanding and addressing the complex issues surrounding girls and their bodies. The book urges society to recognize and celebrate the diversity of bodies and identities while challenging the harmful standards that have been perpetuated throughout history. In doing so, it invites readers to reflect on the way we view and engage with girlhood and the female body, ultimately advocating for a more inclusive and empowering future for American girls.